city of Panama. We've just arrived here in Panama. Miss Jackie, after seven hours on an aeroplane, looking her usual excellent self. But anyway, the point is that um, we're going to do a little film right now showing where she is at this moment so that at the end of the week, hopefully, we can see if there's been any improvement that fast and then we'll watch her over the next few weeks and see what happens. The stem cell treatment has had terrific results, um, so we are very hopeful. Aren't we? A bit nervous, actually. A bit nervous. Well, I'm going to have a bit trepidatious because uh, I don't want to... I don't want to kind of like believe that my life is going to change that radically if it doesn't. I'm saying... Just got to be positive, right? Well, it's not being negative. I just don't want to let myself down badly. You know what I mean? That's understandable. There's uh, lots of things that can help me with, obviously. My bladder. Just just promote your hand shaking a minute because we've never got that on tape. What do you mean? Just try and hold a spoon, pick the spoon. I don't want to throw any cups around. Okay, so this is me. Okay, so this is me. This is just trying to pick up the spoon. See there's no motor control. I can lift weights, that's because the weight, what? Well, it's, it's, it's steady to you. Steady. Okay, so this is the spoon. I can't stir it. Can't stir. Can't, can't write. Can't write my name. I've got no real control. Now, what about in your left hand? Uh, better, but it's, it's actually, I've noticed it's starting to get bad. My left hand. Starting to get where this one was about three or four years ago. So, so placing it into the saucer. Now put it in the side of the saucer. Well, that's not too bad. I mean, no, it's, it's better this one. I've got more control. It's not as good as it was. Right, I mean, right, I understand. Anyways, this okay. is where we are. So can you stand up? Um, and I, I can walk with and without the shaking. A bit. Just walk that way a little bit. That's pretty good. So close. Can't film that close. I'm walking backwards. I'm walking backwards is better than walking forwards. Oh, well, it's, uh, Interestingly enough. Okay. It is Palm Springs by actually. It's awesome. Humid though. It's very humid. Okay. Um, I suppose the energy level. I say energy level at this point is about minus two. It's pretty oh. low. Oh. Okay. Um, that's across the street. Watch, watch where you're going. Go. Find a step there. Keep going, Jacqueline. Food. Huh? Sí, porque si no tienen no puedo yo la pues.
point helps to con keep the disease at bay. So that actually is why we felt that stem cells were really promising in MS because we do get episodes of remission. Yeah. So the idea is to enhance that remission. your own body that's helping you at times to heal, even though it's secondary progressive, but yeah. there are episodes of remission. And that's why it's really encouraging. And that's why we're seeing so dramatic results uh, with MS and hopefully that'll be your yeah. case. And because it's really amazing with, we had two patients here several weeks ago and, uh, and hearing their story of how they were and before and now how you see them now perfectly normal and no problem that's that's really amazing so that's that was the is she one of the ones you've had who's had it the longest that you've ever dealt with she's had it now 20 29 years yeah almost almost 30 no yeah. we've had several but yeah you're you're there you're you're out there <laughs> we have a well it's a, we're, we're going to treat a doctor actually next month who who's 70 years old mm -hmm. And he developed it later in life, so there's a, such a different gamma of patients. There's no, there's no sort of parameters, you know. This disease is so typically it, it, it hits it more, it's, it's it's more women, young, young girls, yeah. younger, etc. But, but uh, you know, you having it for that long of time, you know, again at the same time, doesn't necessarily reduces your likelihood of responding to this one. It's okay. irrelevant doesn't because, seem to have because, a relevance. Yeah, because again, there's still inflammation ongoing there and uh, and that's where we will help okay. enhance that. Okay. Obviously because there's more information out there now, people who are getting MS quicker are being able to investigate and look into options than before they were not there. I mean, when she was first diagnosed, they had trouble diagnosing it. I know, they still have trouble. Because the MRI wasn't so sophisticated. You're right, there's, you're st still, to today, there's a lot of, a lot of patients who are misdiagnosed and, uh, because sometimes the lesions are not the classic, so there's still, still ongoing things. Still. 